Hey guys, what's up? It's Isaac or Jemza or whatever you know me as and today I'm going to be bringing you a little bit of a different video because it's going to be talking about dedication and it, it may seem a little bit weird but go ahead and just listen basically. Now before I start the commentary I want to mention that in the background you are seeing some zombies on Shadows of Evil and I actually got Pack-a-Punch unlocked on round 3. However, I ended up failing extremely hard because I went to look at the Shadow Man or whatever he's called and I was doing it as I was wall running, I looked too far towards him and just fell off and died. And I didn't have quick revive because I was trying to get pack punch hopefully by round 4. I don't think I would have been able to actually just by the amount of zombies there are in round 4. I don't think I would have had enough points. Maybe if I got like double points but I still don't even think with that. But it could have been possible. Anyhow, like I said, today's video is going to be about dedication. And I actually was not thinking about uploading at all today. However, I wanted to make this video and it's not... For dedication to YouTube actually it's going to be dedication with my wrestling now it is also somewhat dedication to YouTube because I have been uploading pretty much every day and I almost missed today but decided to do this video and so I guess I didn't miss today and that's good dedication to YouTube but my main thing here is actually my dedication to wrestling and if none of you guys really know about wrestling uh, there's weight classes and stuff not like WWE shit by the way <laughs> I mean like actual like wrestling like folk style is what I do because I'm in high school and again this is my first year of wrestling if you guys didn't know that by the way and it's pretty fun I do enjoy it quite a bit by the way I had a mixer today which if you guys don't know what that is it's kind of like just a bunch of matches it's like a tournament except it's not like now it's not like a tournament it's more like a duel and except it's not like one team against the other team it's just random basically emphasis on the name mixer so it makes sense if you guys don't know what a duel is then you probably don't know a whole lot about wrestling and I won't really explain too much more and take up too much time with that but anyhow, for this, it's uh, basically like our second half of wrestling because we've been wrestling for like a month now or maybe a little bit longer. And before wrestling started, I weighed about 145 pounds or whatever. And so I was going down and wrestling at 138, which if you didn't know, you have to be like 138.0 or less to be in that weight class. So I was going down and wrestling to that for about the first half. Now, I wanted to go down to 132 because I was certified for that. And so, after we had our first practice since Christmas break started, which was uh, this Monday when we had our first practice since Christmas break started, before that we missed like, I think a whole week of practice, and I had not done anything, so I was just chilling at home, playing Black Ops 3, and just gaining weight basically. And I'd been wrestling at 138 before that, and I weighed 149 this Monday actually. And so obviously I was a long ways away from 132 pounds. However, I was actually able to make it all the way down there. And if you guys don't know, you get a one pound allowance after the Christmas break or whatever, which basically just means for the rest of the year, I can weigh 133 and wrestle 132 but because everybody gets that one pound allowance. So I ended up weighing in at 132.4 I believe. So that's like a 17.1 pound cut I believe because I weighed 149.5 on Monday. And so I did that in like six days. And some people may say that's not a lot of weight, but I'm also not that big of a person either. I was already pretty skinny. Like I wasn't like, you know, like super skinny, but I was a lot skinnier than most people. And so I didn't really have a whole bunch of fat to lose. So for anyone thinking that that's not a whole bunch of weight, you, just, you have to consider my body composition, the fact that I'm not that big already anyhow. So if you do understand that, you understand what I mean by that, then you'd understand that that is actually quite a bit of weight for me anyhow and for my body composition and it uh it was pretty good and the reason that I had to make it actually is because at divisionals when we wrestle you have to be at a certain weight class and you have to wrestle half of your weigh-ins have to be at that certain weight and if they aren't then you won't get to wrestle at that weight class and so being as our we're like halfway through the season already I've been wrestling at 138 for this mixer and the rest of the tournaments and duels that we have for the rest of the year for all of those I have to weigh 132 or I have to wrestle at 132 
which means I can weigh 133.0 or less. So if I didn't make it for this one, I would literally have to go and stick with 138, even though I'm certified to be able to wrestle at 132. So some people may not think this, you know, took much dedication or that it's stupid or that I'm being cocky or anything, but I just kind of want to share with you guys to kind of show that you can do a lot of things even if you think it's difficult. You just have to work at it hard enough and uh, basically not give up. That's also, like I said, kind of goes with YouTube and such as well, but not the thing that sparked up this commentary. Rather, it was my wrestling that sparked up this commentary, but it is relevant to my YouTube uploading as well. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this commentary. It's a little bit longer than my normal videos too, but some people were saying that I need to have longer videos, so I guess uh, that's a win for them. If you did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like because I really do appreciate it. It helps me out a lot more than you guys know. Also, go ahead and leave me some feedback in the comments on anything you think I could improve on, if anything. If nothing, then that's also very awesome and just tell me what you thought of the video and if you enjoyed it or not. And if I should do more commentaries like this where they're a little bit longer and I actually talk about stuff or just whatever type of video you guys do want to see and I'll go ahead and do that as well. Either way, hope you guys have a wonderful day. I love your faces. Peace out.